This video will review information contained in the PDCAT score reports and how to view, print, email, and or save the reports. Score reports may be used to document PDCAT results in a medical or educational record. Score reports are available for each assessment date and for each domain administered. After completion of the PDCAT, a score report is generated immediately by the PDCAT software and can be viewed on the iPad. Score reports may also be printed, emailed, and saved. Score reports can also be exported to Microsoft Excel. Information about exporting scores can be found in the Exporting Scores Report data to Microsoft Excel for the iPad video on the PDCAT website. Score reports may be viewed immediately after completion of the PDCAT when clinician is selected under person completing this assessment. PDCAT score reports can also be viewed any time after the assessment is completed. This can be done by opening the PDCAT program and entering a child's PDCAT ID and then selecting Yes, Start to view the score report page. There are two types of score reports for clinicians to choose from depending on the amount of information required. Clinicians may choose a summary score report or a detailed score report. The main difference between the two reports is that the summary report just provides scores. It can be used to compare test scores from multiple dates or to view scores from one test date. The detailed score report provides test scores plus an item map option. This table shows the difference in content between a summary score report and a detailed score report. In addition to the scores, a summary score report includes the following demographic and test information. PDCAT ID, date of birth, gender, date of assessments completed within a specific date range, domains administered, scaled scores with standard error, normative scores displayed as T-scores, an age percentile range, fit scores, number of items completed per domain, proxy, respondent, and type of PDCAT administered, either speedy or content balanced. A detailed score report provides all of the same information as a summary report for one assessment date. In addition, it includes information about device use, such as crutches, canes, walker, or wheelchair, a list of administered items with responses, and an item map for each domain administered, as well as the type of PDCAT. Here's how a summary score report is displayed for scores from one test date. Here's how a summary score report is displayed with scores from multiple test dates for the same child. To access a detailed report, select View Detailed Report for one assessment. Next, select the session date and then the domain. On the bottom of the screen, select Detailed Report again. Here is how a detailed score report is displayed. Notice that each item and response is listed on this page. To access an item map on the detailed report, select the domain at the top of the screen. Next, select Item Map on the bottom of the screen. Here is an example of an item map. These maps represent the location of item ratings along the continuum of difficulty measured in that domain. For more information about item maps, please refer to Chapter 7 of the PDCAT Manual. In addition to viewing a score report, they can be printed, emailed, and or saved as a PDF file in iTunes. To print, email, or save the score report, tap on the symbol on the bottom left corner of the iPad screen. Next, you will see a pop-up. Select the appropriate option, Print Report, Email Report, or Save Report. The Email Report option is only available if you have email set up on your iPad. 
the print report option is available for printers which are compatible with iPads. Saved reports are stored as PDF files in iTunes. To retrieve the saved report, connect your iPad to your computer. Open the iTunes program on your computer. Select the iPad symbol on the top left corner of the screen. Next, select the word Apps in the left column. Select PDCAT in the second column and you will see a list of files populate in the last column. Select the PDCAT PDF that you would like to save. On the bottom of the screen, select Save To and the location to save the file. Additional information can be found on the PDCAT website.